everybody, it's the Normies, and we're back to watch The Office Season 4, Episode 12, The Deposition. Oh, snap. The D word. Oh, snap. Did I miss something, or do you guys know what this is about? The Deposition? I, know I don't you guys know, do not know what this is about. Okay, then I won't say anything. I'm not uh, sure. It's The Deposition, you all. Deposition. Did, did I, Michael get in trouble now? I'm Mickey. Uh, I'm Spidey. I'm Pat. I'm Serge. It's like Michael's always in trouble. <laughs> I'm, I'm afraid <laughs> for Michael, bro. He <clears throat> must have got sued. Mm. Uh, I'm trying to think what could... Probably we probably have seen whatever it is, but I don't know what it could be. Is it the Meredith thing? I don't know. It, when she got we'll run over, we'll oh, find out. Oh yeah. But she decided not to press sense. charges. Oh though. yeah, we'll yeah. find out. Mm. Uh, but yeah, guys, we're here to watch more Office. I think we're just gonna get right into it. Check out the uncuts on mm -hmm. Patreon. We got a lot of cool stuff on Patreon. And if you can't be a patron, hit the like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. Those are three free things that super duper help us out. They really super duper help us out, guys. Super duper. Super duper. I don't know if you know that or not. <laughs> super duper. Super duper. Super duper duper. I'll call back. <laughs> you never call back. Every time Michael's in a meeting, he makes me come in and give him a post-it note telling him who's on the phone. The thing is, he doesn't get that many calls. So he has me make them up every 10 minutes. Oh, no, no, no. I don't have time for this. <laughs> Tell him I'm in a meeting. <laughs> Mm. Look at Jan, she's like, oh. You have to know how to work this. There's no excuse for this. Hey, he got a beard going on. Huh? Huh? Ah, this <laughs> Hi, buddy. Client. I have the most important client sitting right in front of me, my boss. And I don't want to be rude. Take the call, friend. Hey, would you put the call through? <laughs> I think Ryan knows. That's why he's making him do this. No, no, he just legit doesn't want him to. Hi, buddy. <laughs> Hi, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> now, how long do you think he sat there? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, why did, why did it turn Ryan like that? I used to like Ryan. I still like Ryan a little bit. It's, you know, because, you know, he, you can't really hate on him. He's just moving up the corporate ladder. Yeah, he's I mean, just, you know, he's just, he's, 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 he's. It seems the natural progression of his character. I, just, um, I am on my way to New York to be deposed uh, as part of Jan's wrongful termination uh, lawsuit. Oh. For having the courage to augment her boobs. And they displayed a pattern. What does augment her boobs mean? Change. Yes. Wait, really? She's pattern. suing the company for that? It's a pattern of disrespect mm -hmm. and inappropriate. Up. I don't think that's why you got <laughs> fired, Jen. Tell him how much you're Inappropriate get behavior? Uh, come on, Michael, that's tacky. Million dollars. Four million. Four million dollars! Damn. <laughs> that is a lot of guacamole. <laughs> you ain't gonna get four million. Rise. Jan's answers, oh. and I've also thrown in some hers <laughs> and Oz, oh, just Michael. to make it seem like it's not memorized. Oh, he's just gonna tell the truth. The truth is <laughs> 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 so yeah, I love Jan. Jan. They're my favorite couple on yeah. the show. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, Jan. My hair be like that too when it gets in the wind. A good start. I'm glad you're here. I actually need to talk to you for a second. Can we talk off the record as friends? Oh no. Oh no, you'll fall for this. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Fall Got for him. This. Very tough position. Got him. <laughs> we just want to be sure that you won't do anything to hurt us with your testimony. I'll do anything for the company. That is great to hear. It is. <laughs> oh, oh, who's, he, who's he gonna choose? He's gonna choose the company. The warehouse got a big Ryan's friendship or Jan? Now He's gonna use Ryan's friendship. <laughs> what has two skinny chicken legs and sucks at ping pong? It's not my boyfriend. <laughs> I think it's a guy over here. I don't talk trash. I talk smack. They're totally different. Trash mm -hmm. talk is all hypothetical. Like, your mom is so fat she could eat the internet. <laughs> your mom is so fat she could eat the internet? That's nice. I like that. Like, one. I you you're ugly and I know it for a fact because I get the evidence right there. Trash talk and smack talk, I guess. You have to practice. Was that is that like really pop soda can? Kelly's trash talking me because Daryl's beating you. Seriously, what's she saying? Your boyfriend is so <laughs> weak, he needs steroids just to watch baseball. What? That's, that's <laughs> trash talk. Yeah. That's great. I love that one. <laughs> parents, first cousins that were also bad at ping pong. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, she makes me like her right now. No, renewing your divorce vows before my deposition. <laughs> <laughs> I don't talk until he leaves. Oh just. Okay. You know what? I think they're uh, ready for us now, so. Okay. Oh, man. This is good. <laughs> oh, He's going to choose a cup, and I'm going to hate it. Choose a girl, dude. Can you describe the circumstances of Ms. Levinson's termination? It was a pattern of disrespect and inappropriate good behavior. Good job. 
There are plenty of things that he is well above average at, like ice skating. He is. He's actually <laughs> really good. Very good ice skater. I also got him, Carol. <laughs> How long have you known the plaintiff? I haven't actually seen it, but I have seen the firm, and I'm planning on renting the Pelican Brief. <laughs> <laughs> How long have you known Ms. Levinson? Six years and two months. And you were directly under her the entire time? Okay, that's what she said. Oh, boy. <laughs> that's what she said. Oh, boy. <laughs> Why are you choosing the company, you idiot? Can you go back to where this digression began? Mr. Schneider, and you were directly under her the entire time. Mr. Scott, and that's what she said. Delivery's all wrong. It's bush right now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, man, get some more trash talk, girl. <clears throat> Give it. This yeah, that's what I thought. Hey, I love her right now. Oh, hell yeah. Get the... Out of here. I love her right now. She thought she was being fired. She thought it had to do with the twins. Who are the twins? Come on, you know what he's saying. They hang off the lady's chest. Her breasts. Yes. <laughs> she thought it had something to do with her recent <laughs> breast enhancement surgery. Yes. And, um, <laughs> what about your romantic relationship? It's fault. Could that have played a part in her termination? Before we started dating, disclosed our relationship to HR. Taking a quick look at... Uh, oh, email photo. <laughs> I mean, if it's from the first time we shook hands, it's like six years ago. If it's from the first time we kissed, it's like two years ago. If it was from the first time we kissed sober, it was like <laughs> ago. Can we take a short break? Your relationship began two years ago and not in February as you previously testified. Yeah. <laughs> <Fine. laughs> hey. Good game, Meredith. Don't patronize me. No, All right. What is going on here? Thank God you're here. As it turns out, one of our biggest clients is a ping pong master. Can you help me out? Will you help me practice? Yes. <laughs> the wife's actually good. Dwight seems like he would be good. Yeah, he Damn. What the hell? I told you. All of my heroes are table tennis players. <laughs> <laughs> what? what? And the first time I left Pennsylvania was to go to the Hall of Fame induction ceremony of Andre Gruba. <laughs> oh my <laughs> God. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure those are all real. Oh, 100%. And I know this destroys her case. <laughs> I'm sorry. Thank you. Let's just get that song. Michael, you stupid. You have four million dollars at your hands. We'd like to enter into the record a page from Michael Scott's personal journal. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. What are you doing? This is Plaintiff's Exhibit no. 107. Oh, oh. I quote, just got back from Jamaica. Tan almost everywhere. Jan almost everywhere. I had sex with my boss. I don't know if it's going to go anywhere. Where do they get Jan that? Jan was very specific that this is not going anywhere, but we had sex six times, so you tell me. <laughs> I am definitely feeling very eerie. Irie. Irie. Sorry. What, what did I... Was they were I, in Jamaica. He wrote XOXO to himself. <laughs> what was Irie? Mean? Irie. Ms. Levinson considered you had a relationship in any sense of the word. Is that correct? Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna need to yeah, see yeah exactly. The entire journal before we... That actually helps. The entire journal. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Now yeah. it's been entered, yeah. Uh, Ten copies? Did you make the eleven? <laughs> 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 He's gonna see all the shit talk from him. Oh, hey, man. but that actually helps. That helps. That yeah. helps, right? That means she knew. She brought that as a like a like a Alamo backup. <laughs> she knew that something was he was gonna fuck it up somehow. They're reading oh, it. Oh my no. god. There's probably a bunch of about Ryan in there too. The new temp is so sexy. I wish I were him. Oh. <laughs> I don't even got down oh the secrets. Oh my god. I said, here. I know a little bit about what you're going through in a way. When I was a kid, my parents got divorced. They both asked me to testify against the other one in court. I love them both so much. Michael, don't say anything, Ray, please. <laughs> Whoop his ass, Tony! Beat his ass! He was being so nice! He was leveling with you! That's the only time I didn't agree with Michael Scott. That's the only time I didn't agree with his ass. <laughs> oh my god. I gave it to my lawyer. Michael. He emailed a topless photo of me to everyone in our company. Let's call him. No, he emailed it to Daryl. Daryl emailed it to everybody in the company. I love you. Did she say I love you? Sweet. Okay, yeah. Now I see the moment. Ryan. Will you refer to oh, she did say it. No, 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 he did email it because he meant to send it to Todd Packard and he said send all. <laughs> no, he sent it to Packing and then Daryl sent it to everybody. Oh, yeah, yeah. Jan were engaged in a romantic affair? Not Michael and this Ryan person. <laughs> <laughs> and yes, 
I did consider Jan to be my girlfriend. Jan clearly did not consider me to be her boyfriend. It's admirable the way you defend a woman who is so obviously am ambivalent about her relationship consistently gave you such poor performance reviews. That was before Ooh. our and Oh God! <laughs> Shut the f up! There we go. Can be of a particularly negative oh no, bro! Why are you doing this? This is so dirty, bro. They're bringing out all the dirty laundry. Oh, this is, how, this is what happens yeah, in the deposition, man. This is, this is cutthroat. And that would be a month after your relationship became official, is that correct? Oh. Yes. Jen, what did you say? <laughs> after? <laughs> Mr. Scott has time and again proven himself to be an unmanageable employee. <laughs> I recommend he be removed from that position and reassigned to sales where he belongs. Oh. Wouldn't you say it's that Ms. Levinson's judgment is at least very seriously flawed? Oh boy. That's tough. That's tough. Oh That's boy. Tough. <laughs> He's going to choose the company. Now. <laughs> that hurt. Uh, that hurt. Oh, He's going to no, choose the company. See it. No, f this uh. ping pong. <laughs> How's it going? So, should I schedule the rematch with Daryl now? Are you ready? Oh, Daryl me... is the client? <laughs> Works here, dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> right. Spencer. <laughs> <laughs> Disappointed. Michael, I'm not the enemy, okay? Dunder Mifflin is the enemy. Dunder Mifflin? Yeah, Dunder Mifflin. That's always treated me. No! <laughs> Lester, please read that part of Wallace's deposition. Oh, sh <laughs> Wallace is there too? Was he a contender to replace Jan Levinson? Yes. Okay. Was he your first choice? What do you want me to say? Come on, he's a nice guy. Was he being seriously considered for the corporate job? No. <laughs> Michael, everybody's betrayed you. Just follow your heart. <laughs> Go with your girl! Four million dollars. And your girl. That the company exhibits a pattern of disrespect toward its employees. Absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> Michael, you stupid. <laughs> Way to go. See that? Yeah, the floppy haired girl you did won a point. <laughs> God, I don't give a <laughs> about this B story. Nice, baby! Nice! <laughs> hey, hey, you, you, I don't like <laughs> This could be fun behavior, but. Because it's like the thing. Let's go, you and me. Oh! oh yeah. Okay, alright, this is getting good. Okay. Oh. Uh, sir, P. Oh. Oh, boy. P. Oh. <laughs> Let me take oh. Yes. <laughs> they just want to play ping pong. <laughs> Michael's an idiot. Michael, I, I, I can't, I can't say anything this episode. I am very sorry. Oh, hey, okay. David Wallace is a nice no. guy, though. This yeah, he didn't. He wasn't like overly rough. Or yeah. Really. I think you're a nice guy too. Thanks, Michael. <laughs> he played you, Why Michael. Do do Still is. I don't know. Jan said. It was because of the photo that she revealed the diary, but she already brought the diary with her to New York. So you expect to get screwed by your company, hmm. but you never expect to get screwed by your girlfriend. You. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Also, it's good that she brought it. <laughs> they got a ride together. What do you want to do for me? four million dollars? <laughs> she don't four leave million. you ass. I, I don't think she had a. I don't think it would have. I don't think she had her case. Yeah, yeah she was. She was erratic. I do fast food. Fine. <laughs> this is depressing. <laughs> Mo's. <laughs> Man, Mo's got skills. Both of yeah, I wonder if that was real. Mm -hmm. I think it was. That was, <laughs> <laughs> that was intense. Uh, pause it. No oh, man. Oh man, the I need to talk to some more kids. That one was deep, man. That one kind of hurt. Yeah. They they they, they 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 like took stabs at Michael so hard, right? <laughs> like so hard. But, but but at the same time, Michael was a dick for doing what he did to Toby. Yeah, and <laughs> also he's always a dick to Toby though. Yeah, he, that. he he take that out of the equation. Every, everyone's a dick to Toby. Yeah, but like Toby <laughs> was trying to like level with him. Like, he always like, does. Take that out of the equation. Oh no, Michael, that was kind of dick move. I I, I usually support Michael with all, all this. <laughs> that, that, that was kind of dick, but also, man, I just wish you would have made the right decision. Just stuck with that, with this girl, and you know, got the full million dollars. Yeah, but sticking with this girl, you think the company is gonna be? I mean, like now he's part of this lawsuit against the company that he works for. Like, 
Mm-hmm. You know, if, if, if I, if I they, think that, that'd be retaliation. That's, that's true. That's, be, then, then he'll get then he'll get more money. So they wouldn't do yeah, that. You know, I don't, I don't think I it was million? the fact that she brought the picture, the diary. I think it was the fact that she gave him a very poor performance review one month after they started dating. I think that played into it, but also like her having that on the ready already <laughs> feels like betrayal because she stole it because he leaves it under her pillow. But she didn't know about the picture. That was a little bit betrayal on Michael's end. It wasn't him that brought it out, though. The other yeah. lawyer brought it out. That's yeah, she so brought that's why he was like, like that's a, fucked up. She brought it as like a smoking gun because she knew he was going to fuck it up, mm-hmm. <laughs> like regardless of the practice. Yeah. He did say line. <laughs> <laughs> he said like we're in a play like we're in- <laughs> oh my god that would have been a- oh Michael 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 oh, so then you asked to go to the bathroom no that was just to avoid a question <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that would have been that case, was a great line. That would have been yeah. case closed for the de- defense, man. The, the, <laughs> he gave them everything. He chose the fucking company. Yeah, yeah. Like, he was never considered for a corporate nope. either, dude. He and then then what it was like company Wallace. I, I think Wallace was playing him the whole time, and even at the end, Wallace played him. I don't think that was genuine. No, uh, David Wallace is like just a regular businessman, man. He's gonna make the right decision for the company. Would you have hired Michael for that corporate yeah. job, honestly? I don't, yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah, I don't think anything David said. Like was like overly harsh. Like yeah. he was just like he was like yeah he was considered but not really. You yeah, know? he was like he's a nice guy. What do you want me to say? Yeah. No, he wasn't in the top five. And like he apologized to Michael at the end. You know. And yeah. He was like, which like I mean, that's what can you do? I heard that that actor do. that plays David Wallace is like an actual retired businessman or something. Uh, and like that's he why he like gets it. off that demeanor like really well. He does. Yeah, definitely. That was what the. Quote of you expect to get screwed over by your company, but not your girlfriend. And so damn near like, damn, that was some, that was a good one, Mike. <laughs> was, yeah. uh, but then he said screwed by your girlfriend, which like, thankfully yeah. you do want to get screwed. Right, you know. Like, I know what you mean. Giggity. It was still, he, Michael has his morals, I guess, in his own, his own weird way. Uh, fucking Mindy. I don't like Mindy Kaling and her that much, but she did this episode. She is, yeah, she was funny. <laughs> the, she was awesome. I love the track. Said, Your she boyfriend's so weak he needs steroids to, to watch, watch baseball. baseball. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's a good one. Wait, what was it? Your your boyfriend is so weak he needs to he needs to take steroids to watch baseball. That's hilarious. <laughs> and the other one was that uh oh you're so ugly, all the evidence is right here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> she's been on fire this season. It's like the I'm pregnant and she does a head shake. <laughs> That's one of her funniest. He's like, You lied about being pregnant. She's like, so? Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> why not? <laughs> yeah. Oh man. So, well, that was Jan's gambit. I guess. Yeah. That was a that was a hail mary gambit. I mean, hail mary. I, I don't a, think they would have got the four two. Wasn't. Yeah. But maybe they could have gotten like a set. You know, a couple mil. Sort of yeah, they got a set, yeah. Not even a couple mil. I think they would have talked them down to like a hundred thousand. Yeah. And I think they would have took it. Which would have been nice still. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Million? Like you're super high, and then you settle for four still. million dollars. He's had to lie a little bit. <laughs> the list of things I will not do gets real small at four, at four million, million dollars. dollars like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you had to work that one out, Michael. Oh, man. Michael, solid. And then that the uh, Ryan coming to talk to him. Let me talk to you off the wreck as a friend. I was like, yeah, that was kind of uh, slimy. Yeah, very slimy, very slimy. And like this is also the company that. I know he didn't ask for it, but he didn't get a raise, right? He was like making barely more than Daryl. No, yeah, oh, yeah. he yeah. didn't get a raise for ten years. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, he's been getting screwed. And, like for that's kind of dumb that he didn't ask for it, but also it's like he kind of expected like, it. Like it's uh, like they uh, purposely he, put him there because yeah. they knew he wouldn't ask. Or yeah, something. you're. Ex- isn't like a yearly raise like expected though? Yeah, mm-hmm. it's expected, not always guaranteed. Yeah, but. If you're in a regional manager position, you right? Should. And the Dunlop you method when you're like what have so many branches. Uh, I, oh man, I I wish we did one. Even after the merger, like when they took all of all the new people, he didn't get a raise. Yeah. Uh, mm. <laughs> well, 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 that was good drama. I like that one. Yeah. Okay. Time to hit that dusty trail. Hey, dusty, dusty, dusty. Hey, if you want to watch more Office, you got to wait one week. Or, oh. or, you should know what else you could do. Peace. Bye. Peace.
What's up, guys? Thank you for joining us for another episode of The Office. Shout out to our super patrons, Jacob D. Van Horn, Raga Gopal Krishna, Keyboard Junkie, and Joe Max. And let us know where your cringe meter is in the comments down below.